when we were first contemplating building a fully mobile construction robot, I mean, this was complete madness in the eyes of a lot of people, but not for us. I mean, we've got another two billion people projected to join us on the planet over the next 30 years. We haven't worked out how to house those people yet. And it wasn't until we had a bricklayer shortage in 2005, it was right time to produce a, a very large machine that could um, build an entire house more efficiently than humans can. It's the wear and tear on people with bricks and mortar and cement I don't have to worry about any risks such as working at height, manual labour, chemicals, wastage. It's just so much safer. The way to convince investors is to show clear progress. Seeing that first brick come down, that was the satisfying moment like no other. It's a challenging step to establish in another country. You've got the business challenges of a whole different business community and potentially a different business mindset. It is never a straight line. But I, I find that really interesting because it, it, there's a, a really good opportunity to learn there. This is a journey that has over 100 people in the team, 13,000 shareholders, and a business and an investment community and an industry watching what we're doing. Don't be a solution looking for a problem. Tackle a problem and find the solution. <laughs>